Welcome back to Magic Gathering Strat. We're doing round four, the final round of this Soulforge Unheroic Tournament. Um, we're on the play, which kind of sucks. Um, and we'll just play a Swamp Moss Lurker for a little... And this kind of sucks too. Yes, sorry. Alright, so we can always siphon. We're not getting the guys we want to level up in level 1, though. Right now. Siphon's good on that guy, though. For his 3 toughness. And you... Oh, yeah. So we'll take a little damage, it's fine. Um, I mean, I guess we can just make this guy huge and just hit him, right? Take 17. Why not? There's a batter hide, thank goodness. Swamp Moss Lurker, of course, does not have Breakthrough, so pretty easy to block. But he's a pretty monstrous level 1 guy. Oh, it's another Donkster Frankenbaum deck. Man, I gotta tell you, I don't like him. <clears throat> Fine. Um, I think we'll just get guys. Yeah, we'll take a little bit of damage, but it's not too bad. A couple seals, uh, they're so horrible at level 1, but they're really nice at level 3. So hopefully we just get an opportunity where they make a difference. Because in the end, you just want to keep your guy on the board with 1 health, that's fine, he's going to hit again. Your opponent's going to have to deal with him again. Um, that can make all the difference. There goes my batter hide. That guy dies. Hmm. Alright, well. We'll level up one seal, I guess, and get the other swamp moss lurker. Level 2 now, so these guys all of a sudden got magically better, which I like. See, the entire hound's always good. Owns the entire round. Yes, well. This guy says minus three, minus three. Yeah, we'll take a little damage from it, but I'm kind of okay with that. Um, and we'll get our. Clear the field there. Not looking too good. We're not getting much in the way of breakthrough, guys. The 
He can kill that guy. It's fine. <clears throat> oh, man. Well. I mean, we can just spirit... Oh, we can't spirit cleave that guy. We gave up that chance, I guess. Um... We can simply kill this guy and seal you. Take a little eight damage. That's ridiculous. All right, so there's our batter hide. Thank goodness. And a dizzy and siphon. This is at minus five and plus five right now, which is pretty effective. I'd love to hit with that Swamp Moss Lurker, but I, yeah, it's not happening. It makes me sad. Dr. Frankenbaum. Um, so, he's a threat. I can't kill him right now. I don't want to put my batter hide in front of him either. So, batter hide in the middle, siphon, you die. You get bigger. Hit you. I think it's the second time I've seen this Dr. Frankenbaum deck. It's pretty interesting. Um, just win, so you let your guys die, but just win with uh, all this incidental damage. And it's a fun idea. Yeah, we can get the Shardbound Invoker. I'm going to kill Dr. Frankenbaum. These guys can trade, I don't care. He's the biggest threat. I'm going to keep our damage out there. Yeah. He's actually winning this race, even though we've kept board position this whole time. Um, gives a guy minus six, minus six now. It's pretty good. Dissian Siphon is plus 18, plus 18. Or that's Seal of Deep Woods plus 18, plus 18, and that's up to seven. So we have some good cards hanging out here now. <clears throat> Our breakthrough guy's going to die. Question is whether or not he put something... Yeah, he just put something in front of my Swamp Moss Lurker. Alright, well, we can siphon and seal. That's going to be a big shot. Why not go for it? <clears throat> That's a level 2 Swamp Moss Lurker, folks. And you are going to have to throw things in front of him relentlessly. Level 3 Seal of Deepwood is just so crazy. Giving anything. Plus 18, plus 18 is just ridiculous. Alright, well. And this is fine. Um, we just get other guys, and they're going to beat the snot out of you, too. OK, 
Okay, but you still need to throw guys in front of him. Oh man, all level ones? And not very good ones, but we do have lethal over here again. Maybe I should have played my 7-7 seven, seven just for that extra little bit of damage to get through. But he really has to watch out for that Swamp Moss Lurker. Both the Swamp Moss Lurkers. the batter hide because I was kind of hoping to get a plus 18 plus 18 for him but probably the 7-7 seven, seven would have been better just uh, just on numbers because uh, this game's not going to go much longer one way or another we're going to get that last 23 in I think Oh, he gets a little life back. Look at him. Now what? That dude. <clears throat> um, that's fine, but we're just going to kill you now. All right, we went 4-0. That was pretty exciting. Our tournament is complete. We get four event tickets. We get all our event tickets back and a gold pack. Let's open that up. Three heroics and three rares. Energy Prison, Right of the Grim Gaunt, and Venomous Nether Scale. Nice. All right, well, that's pretty exciting. These, uh, unfortunately, these unheroics are going to be going. We're going to join one more. Oh, we'll use the same deck, even. We're not going to play it right now. Now, we're playing this uh, deck by Upshot, which is uh, Necroian Utera Proto. Yes. Uh, we're not going to play right now, but this way, at least, we won't. Uh, we'll get a chance to play in this I think at some point hopefully tomorrow we can get our rounds in uh, so thanks for watching Magic Gathering Strat I'm Bava I was playing Soul Forge in these Weekend Warrior Unheroic tournament and uh, had a really good time so check it out uh, when these show up they're not here all the time but it's kind of Soul Forge's version of Popper it's a really great way to uh, learn the game you can find some cool deck lists online to play like I did today uh, thanks for watching I'll catch you all next time